Hey everybody out there, it's Brandy. Um, I am doing a quick update on my Hot for Halloween challenge that I'm doing um, for Stacy's channel. Um, I hope everybody's doing well. I hope we're all reaching our goals and uh, making good choices, which I'm sure we all are. And um, so I'll let you in on kind of what happened for me the last week or so. Um, first and foremost, I turned 30. Yay! Can you tell I'm excited? Um, it's, it's a love and hate relationship when you turn 30. Um, I don't know how many of you went through that yet, but uh, you love it and you hate it. You feel like you get a little bit more wiser, a little bit smarter, you make better decisions, but let's face it, we're getting older. Once you hit that 30 mark, kind of seems like everything gets a little harder. It's a little harder to lose weight. It's a little harder to do everything. I wake up with a little bit more back pain in the morning. So, needless to say, um, good news is I had a wonderful birthday. I went um, to Seattle with my sister and one of my good friends, and we definitely shopped a lot and... Um, hung out and were very silly and had an amazing time. Um, but along with that, I drank and I made decent food choices, but hey, let's face it, they weren't all great. <laughs> um, so I think last week when I checked in, I was 157.2 or one. Honestly, I don't know. I didn't look at my video this morning. I'm just kind of uploading this before I head to work. Um, but I was 157 point, I want to say one or two, and yesterday uh, I weighed in, and I already knew this was going to be a high number. For one, when you drink, the next couple days you tend to bloat, and it's because your body's like, hello, I'm super dehydrated, give me, give me, give me water. So, yesterday I was 162. <laughs> I don't like saying that, but um, the good news is, is that today I'm already back down to 160.1 so I'm basically almost back into the 150s I'm gonna say just for the sake of saying it I really only gained about three pounds two and a half pounds um, and most of it like I said is bloat I'm not worried about um, this weight staying on um, like Stacy said you know what during weight loss journey there's times you go up there's times you go down but what's most important is that you are on the progressive down, meaning, you know, month to month, you keep losing a little and a little and a little, um, but day to day, week to week, I mean, you know, there's a fly in here and it's going to drive me nuts. Um, and my dog's staring at me through the door and he's like, let me in to the house. But, sorry, totally got distracted there. Um, as long as you're going down progressively every month, that's what's important. It's not really so important if you go up a pound, down a pound. I mean, Jesus, we're women. We go through cycles. Um, we go through hormone changes. We gain water weight. We lose water weight. I mean, it's, you know, it is what it is. It's a crazy journey. But I can definitely say that by next week, I will be back down in the 150s. I have no qualms about it. I'm not worried whatsoever. Um, about that. Yes, my goal is 149 by November 1st. I'm saying November 1st because it's just easier for me. Um, I'm going to weigh myself November 1st. That's going to be my end day, not really Halloween. I don't know. I just, I just can't end on, on a 31. I'd rather just end on a one, I guess. I don't know. I'm a weirdo. Um, but so far, so good. I probably would have gained more in Seattle if I wasn't walking the entire time we were there. I can definitely say that probably helped keep my weight down just a tad. So anyhow, um, sorry, it's my phone. I am going to get going. I have a long day at work and I hope everybody out there is being successful, making good choices. And even if you're not, you know, just remember that the next meal is the next chance to make it different. You don't have to um, scratch a whole day because, hey, you had a piece of cake or, you know, some chips or whatever. I mean, for last night, I'm not going to lie, I had about a half a cup of ice cream. But it was delicious, and I enjoyed it, and I savored it <laughs> because I was craving it, and I needed to have it. But I didn't go overboard, and I also didn't um, 
crash diet, I guess, whatever, all night long. I didn't go and eat a bunch of stuff because I'm like, ah, oh, screw it. I ate ice cream. Let's just ruin the whole day. No, I had a half a cup of ice cream and I called it good. And I still lost weight this morning. So, just tells you, you don't have to always ruin your whole day just because you decided to have a Big Mac for lunch or whatever. You know, just say, hey, next meal, I got to get back on plan. That's what you got to do. Anyway, I'm going to get going, like I said, like 10 minutes ago, and I'm going to stop talking now. Um, I hope everybody's doing well. I'm proud of everybody, and I can't wait to see everybody's progress. So I will see you all later. Ciao, bellas.